The US has just pulled back the curtain on its futuristic and largest known sea drone to date, following successful tests off the California coast. Shaped like a manta ray, this cutting-edge underwater drone, developed by Northrop Grumman, represents a new class of drone technology for the US Navy. The reveal comes as the US is rapidly pushing to develop its drone capabilities. Under the title of the Replicator Drone Program, the Pentagon is accelerating its drone development with a clear focus to counter Chinese maritime advancements. With robust spending of $500 million annually, the goal is to deploy thousands of autonomous combat-ready sea drones over the next 18 to 24 months. The announcement of the Manta Ray project coincides with this critical investment in US autonomous capabilities, potentially inspired by Ukraine's successful use of sea drones against the Russian Black Sea Fleet. Funded by the Defense Advanced Research Projects Agency, or DARPA, the Manta Ray is an underwater vehicle that resembles its namesake. Its sleek design allows it to glide through the water efficiently, but what makes it truly stand out is its size. Although exact measurements haven't been disclosed, it's one of the largest drones ever developed for the US Navy. But more than just a large drone, the Manta Ray is designed for endurance and versatility. It's equipped with energy-saving technologies that enable it to operate on the ocean floor for extended periods, undertaking surveillance and intelligence-gathering missions in environments inaccessible to humans. Kyle Warner, the DARPA program manager, highlighted the drone's ability to be rapidly assembled in the field from modular sections and its potential for a wide range of naval missions. Northrop Grumman has engineered the Manta Ray for easy shipment in standard shipping containers, supporting expedient deployment anywhere in the world. Once at the location, it can be quickly assembled and launched from a warship or directly at the shore, reducing the need for pier space and conserving the drone's energy for actual missions. With its completion of successful sea trials, the Manta Ray is now moving towards real-world operational testing. DARPA is currently coordinating with the US Navy to determine the next steps in bringing this cutting-edge technology into regular service. The US Department of Defense is rapidly pushing the development of unmanned systems like the Manta Ray, which they believe represents an important development in the future of naval operations. Understanding the global context that shapes these advancements is essential. Recent conflicts have demonstrated the strategic value of drones in modern warfare. For instance, Houthi attacks using drones have shown their effectiveness in surveillance and combat, forcing the US and Allied navies to respond with expensive countermeasures. Similarly, the conflict in Ukraine has showcased the strategic use of sea drones. The reported use of unmanned surface vessels by Ukrainian forces, for example, to attack Russian naval assets, highlights the tactical advantage and potential of such technologies. Again, with these naval drones costing in the low hundreds of thousands, compared to the destroyed Russian ships valued in the tens or hundreds of millions. This program is not just about keeping up, but setting the pace, ensuring that the US remains at the forefront of military technology, learning from global conflicts, and integrating these lessons, as China and Russia attempt to do the same.